Okay, first fight of the evening is a five, four and a half minute round bout for the World Reef Sports Association English title. In the blue corner, fighting out in the studio, 2000 Jimmy in Derby, Jordan Macy! You ruined it. English title at 41 kilos. James Pierce from Wicker Camp going to work there. Nice tidy clinch work. These guys, these guys actually fought six weeks ago on, on the Sai Valley show in Derby. It was a controversial draw. So they've decided to rematch here on Showdown 9. And these two young guys go straight to work. Here in the commentary box, we've got Phil Glover. Hi, Rich. So we're going to be asking Phil some, some of his expert opinion later on. He'll be adding comments in every now and again. Some beautiful low kick action there from James Pierce out of the wicket camp. Chopping the legs up left and right. Jordan on the back foot, scoring really well with his body kick. Jordan just turned his back a little bit there in the clinch. That's going to go against him. If you seem to sort of turn your back in the clinch, that's a that's a bad sign. You say he'd be getting scored on the, across his back. And there's the end of the first round. So Phil, I know it's early doors. First round. Are you giving I'd, it any direction one way or the other? Uh, I'd I'd say. Uh, Blue corner first round, but it's, it's pretty close. So it's early doors yet, ain't it as well? Um, you know, I mean the uh, uh, James looked pretty strong with the uh, low kicks, but like you say, uh, Jordan scored well with body shots. Two. Just as James Pierce comes out of the corner there, his corner screwing him. Find another gear. I think James is actually the stronger of the two fighters, but Jordan's scoring really well with his body kicks. You say the, the low kicks that, that James is putting in the back. These will gain interest as the fight goes on. Ooh, that was a beautiful technique there from Jung James Pace. He's a strong lad. Nice sharp jab there to the body of Jordan. Jordan Jordan's corner telling him to step in and look for the knees, look for the clinch work. But James. Coming backwards and forwards, sometimes on the front foot, sometimes on the back foot, adapting really well. Again, another good kick, kick catch there from James. Jordan very busy in the clinch. Just seems to be turning his back a little bit there, and that's going to work against him. 
Still looking the strong win to James. Again there to show showing his dominance. And there we go, the end of round two. What do you think of that one, Rich? Yeah, there's certainly the uh, lad in the, in the red corner, young James Pierce. He's, put, he's putting the work in. He seems the stronger of the two, dominating. He's, uh, he's caught the kick, his, uh, his push kicks a couple of times in that round really yeah. well. Yeah. Um, so that, that's going to be money in the bank. So here we go for round three. Pressure on. Even though Jordan seems to be on the back foot, he's scoring really well with his push kick and he's be using his push kick to, to, to off balance James Moore. That push kick scoring really well there. He's following the instruction really well from his corner. And uh, I think this, uh, this round could be swing, uh, swing into in the, in the blue corner's favour. Yeah, it's a much better round, this one. Again, that nice, nice push kick there from young, young Jordan. James trying to pile on the pressure, using, using the low kicks to, to good effect. March in the, in the red corner. Just telling young James Pierce to step in and use his clinch work because he seems the stronger of the two. Again, some nice spot, nice knees there by young James Pierce. Yeah. But Jordan, Jordan was scoring really well using his push kick to great effect there. And he's turned that, that round around. John needs to be using that, using that push kick to, to keep James at bay and to avoid getting his, getting his leg kicked. Here we go for round four. Round four. Of this English title action. There's no stopping these two, Rich. I know it's all action. Yeah, the strength. Yeah, they're only 41 kilos. Good. Two little pocket rockets. Going at it for this English title. You can see the aggression on young James Pierce's face. When he throws those low kicks, really throwing his body weight through it. And that's having a telling effect on John Mason's front leg. Jordan trying to push in, push into the clinch. But that's the last place he wants to be because James needs to be the stronger of the two. John needs to be using his push kick more because that's what's going really well for him. And there we have it again. <laughs> I think he just heard you then, Rich. <laughs> Yeah, you're right, he's, he's, uh, his front kicks are working well for him, he's not using him this round. Yeah, that, that, that's what worked well for him in the, yeah. in the third round. And again, good takedown again there. Yeah, really, really good catch, really well timed technique. That's going to score highly for James. Jordan trying to maintain that distance, keep it longer range, because he, he has got a slight height advantage. A better round there for, uh, for James. Yeah, James, James turning the pressure back on. But is that enough? <laughs> it 
It's all up for grabs. This WRSA English title matched at 41 kilos. And here we go for round five. It's all in the balance. One, one and a half minutes. Again, another thunderous pace there from James Pierce. Well, great balance shown by Jordan. And he seems to be scoring really well. Beautiful right knee there, but a loss of balance. Negate, negates the, the knee that landed earlier. Some nice countering techniques here from Young Jordan in this last round, lifting up that body kick really well. Jordan piling the pressure on. Both these guys have won, won this title so much. They haven't stopped working for the full five rounds here. He's having a better round this time, uh, 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 Jordan. Certainly is. Jameson seems to have lost that, lost that little spark. Yeah. Is that going to be enough? <laughs> the side of me, we have the, one of the unofficial scorecards, Mr. Dave Jackson. He's giving it to the blue corner. Phil? I, know, I, I think maybe a draw for this one. Um, We'll be having a D repeat from El Paso restaurant. Jordan came back, back in El Paso later on. He scored lowest from the knees. Yes, he did. Uh, D repeat. I have it to draw myself. OK, ladies and gentlemen, let's give both fighters a big round of applause. Well done. Strong. Slamming in those low kicks. James was retreating, but he was scoring really well using using his push kick and long knee to good effect. You can see how these guys have been so close in the action. I dare say they'll meet again in the future. Thank you. 